Iran's foreign minister is accusing the White House of hypocrisy. Today the region is a powder keg. The U.S. security establishment is directing the war in occupied Palestine. The Zionist regime is suffering internal collapse. I talked to Russian Foreign Minister Lavrov and we are consulting with China as well that a resolution against the interests of Palestinians will not be adopted at the UN Security Council. Palestinian resistance groups say they're ready for a long military conflict. They said Israel targets civilians, including women and children. The US has sent messages to Lebanon's Hezbollah asking not to open a new front in the conflict. We've received messages asking us to practice restraint and also asked us to invite others to show restraint. But the US over the past two weeks has been sending military equipment to Israel. So how can they say they don't want the expansion of war? Now I'm saying to Biden, stop your hypocrisy. Dorsa Jabari has got more from the Iranian capital. Iranian Foreign Minister Hossein Amir Abdullahian made it very clear that he's been making all kinds of efforts on the diplomatic front to try and de-escalate the situation, but also bring some kind of uh, resolution to the humanitarian crisis that is unfolding in Gaza. The Iranian Foreign Minister said he's spoken to the leader of Hamas as well as Islamic Jihad over the past 24 hours, during which the men discussed the ongoing conflict. And uh, the two Palestinian men made a very very clear that they understand this could be a long haul, uh, this conflict, and they are ready for the long fight. Uh, the Iranian foreign minister also for the first time uh, said that Iran has been receiving messages through a third party from the United States urging uh, the Iranians to show restraint uh, as well as to exert their influence on the uh, various groups in the region for them not to escalate uh, the situation. But the foreign minister made it very clear that these groups are independent of Iran and the act of their own volition. He also said that uh, the hypocrisy that the United States has displayed has never been more evident. He said they're talking about us showing self-restraint when they themselves have been supplying weapons for the past two weeks to Israel and also moving their warships closer in this region. Uh, he had the following message for U.S. President Joe Biden. Uh, Hossein Amir Abdullahian says, how can you talk, uh, how can you say that they, um, you don't want an expansion of this war? And now I'm saying to Biden, stop your hypocrisy. Those words from the foreign minister. He also said that he's been meeting with the Russian foreign minister here in Tehran, uh, Sergei Lavrov, uh, during which the, uh, the, the meetings he talked about uh, China as well as Russia using their veto power at the Security Council to prevent the United States from passing through any kind of a Security Council resolution uh, on uh, the ongoing war in Gaza. Dorsa Jabari, Al Jazeera, Tehran.